Hey guys, it's my week of Curlbox and I'm in Fort Myers, Florida today and I'm hanging out with Rochelle Graham Campbell of LK Naturals. I'm here at the headquarters today and we're gonna talk about how she started on YouTube and started making these products on YouTube to Etsy to a website to Target and Alice Alley's. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, okay, so you started on YouTube. Yeah, I started making videos honestly just because I was learning about my hair. Okay. And back then, YouTube wasn't really what it was. We had, it was back in 2008. Okay. And I was like, oh my gosh, we're transitioning from a website called Fotkey, Fotkey, whichever yeah, one. Yeah, I know. And, I love that. Yeah, and that was, was like, just pictures, right? It was just pictures, but like all of us, like naturals became so obsessed. Like we would post like everything and okay. it just started to go into overload. Okay. And then a few ladies started transitioning to YouTube and filming like how to do two strand twists and simple videos. Okay. So when I was going to try to make my first puff, I was like, why not film it and try to figure it out on camera? And okay. that's how I really started on YouTube. So you were in college in 2008. Yeah. And people are watching your videos and you're going through a bunch of products. And I have to say products, I mean, the fact, like I said, now that we have products like yours in Target and in these Sally's, this was not the case then. No. And this wasn't even the case a few years ago. Sure. There were only a handful um, that were accessible. You decide, okay, I'm gonna start making my own stuff. Yeah, because at that point, again, college budget, Height. And I was yeah. like, I was so sick and tired of wasting money on products. Yeah. And then they didn't work. Like mm -hmm. my twist outs were a mess and I can't return it. It was mm -hmm. just a waste of money. And I was okay. like, you know what? Unless there are products out there that had natural ingredients, which is what I was looking for, mm -hmm. and that actually worked the way they said they would, yeah. I was just gonna just start making my own. I grew up in Jamaica, born okay. and raised, and my okay. grandma is a Jamaican herbalist. Okay. So everything we did growing up was like all natural. So natural herbs, natural oils, like if it didn't grow outside, we weren't using it. Okay. So I was like, why not take that like approach and create things to fix my hair needs? So wow. that's how I created the Essential 17. It's 17 ingredients all in one bottle, and they actually work. Oftentimes people ask me, how much money do I need? They think that they need a zillion dollars to start. There are some businesses that require a ton of capital, but not all of them do, and everyone's thinking like, I need to open a boutique, and it's like, sell what you have where you yes. can, and then if the demand, people will let you know what they want more of. Exactly, start like start with what you have, and I think that that was something that I'm happy that I took that approach, because mm -hmm. $100 doesn't sound like a lot, mm -hmm. but it was all I had. Like were, I bust my butt waiting for the, tables for those $100. You, and you were in college, yeah. and listen, $100, $100 in college was... It's, it's everything. It's everything, <laughs> it really is. When did you start to decide, okay, I'm gonna go to the next step with this. I'm gonna take the money that I made from these 10 or 12 bottles and I just kept like, you know, reinvesting it back mm -hmm. into the company. Okay. So that's one of the things that I really pride ourselves on now because to this day, we still have no funding. Right. And so we've just been bootstrapping for the past six years of business, right. just putting everything back into our business and right. it's good. Right. You know, it kept me, you know, being accountable. Yep. And I was like, okay, so I made these growth oil. My leave-in conditioner I was using was awful that I was purchasing, so okay. I made one. And okay. then I needed a moisturizer, then I needed a deep conditioner. So I just started creating the products as I needed them, okay. and just fortunately, they actually sold. Okay, that's awesome. You started off in how many Target doors? We started off in 100 Target doors, okay. and that was March 2014. Just last year? Yeah, just last year, so it's like, you know, still fresh and new. Okay. And that was the, our first, like, mass, like, retail chain, but before that, we were in 65 independent retail locations worldwide. Okay, okay. So, you know, we still had those accounts and we had those, you know, great relationships. Wow. So Target was just a new, okay. you know, new relationship A for new us. relationship. And so um, how many SKUs, how many products do you have in Target? <sighs> oh my gosh, in Target we have six. Okay. So, and they're, you know, some of the, the favorite products, like the okay. staples that are okay. in everyone's regimen. Okay. But all together, my line has 60 products. Wow. And I created everyone myself. <laughs> oh, wow. That's awesome. Sally's, this is a new. Yes. You, it's, you are officially. In. Yes, we're officially as of last month in wow. over 500 Sally's. That is incredible. And and I was saying, I, what I love about Sally's, Sally's is the place that you can literally go get everything. Yes. Like you can go to Sally's. Like, like you said, if you're watching a YouTube video and you need clips, Hair bonnets. Yes, anything. Cakes. I mean, if you, you need write cake, down the checklist, bowls, the then bowl, you go. the mixing bowls, yes. everything you need. So I love the fact that people will be able to find you there. Yes, walk in, grab your lemongrass, grab your growth oil, grab your creme brulee, go home and do your wash and go and twist out, and okay. you're good. Okay. And what, what are some of the? And you're a mom. You have a son. Yes. Um, and you're married, and you have businesses. Yes. Um, what have you found to be most challenging? 
Um, I would say, you know, truthfully speaking, the most challenging thing for me at this stage is taking time for myself. Mm -hmm. um, I am so determined and I'm so focused and I'm so committed yeah. because I love Alec Hay. Like, I, I love my, my entire company. Okay. But I have to learn that I have to put myself first. I have to, you know, schedule time for myself in the day. Yeah. You know, so it's, it's not as easy as it sounds to take time for myself, but I have to. You're putting it's yourself just, back yeah, on the Yeah, I have to. Awesome. Okay. And then, so, you have a salon, which we're going to see. Yes. And we're going to just keep in, keep talking about, like, all things girly, all things Allocate today. Yeah. It's all about Curlbox Natural and the Allocate Takeover. Okay, I told you we were going to be stopping by the salon that you own. Um, what is the name of the salon? The Fabulous Salon. So this salon is all about being fabulous. And where are we? We're actually in Fort Myers, Florida. So it's in between Naples and Tampa. Awesome. I visited both Naples and Tampa. So when you say be fabulous, that sounds like a one-stop shop to become fabulous. Can I come in here and literally be fabulous from head to toe? Yeah, exactly. And that was actually my inspiration when um, I started this salon here. I want women, and even men as well, to just really walk in and any service that you need you should be able to get it done here so everything from head to toe head to toe okay so <laughs> since we're we'll start with the head so is this the kind of salon that if, if I'm getting a twist out or a braid out is that the only thing I can get here no and that's you know something we wanted to really expand on because we know naturals it's no longer we're not in a box anymore no like we do protective styles so if you want protective styles whether it's, you know with you know Marley, Marley crochet. Hair, crochet so wins. It doesn't matter what you want. Box braids, twists, we can actually do it. That's awesome. Okay, so we know we can get that. And then you also do nails here. Yeah. So you've got manicures. Yeah, manicures and pedicures, gel, like the bling nails. So any kind of creative inspo that you can think of, like our um, nail tech can create. Gotcha. And then I think I even saw like a spa in here. Yeah. So you can get a, mas a massage room. You can get, like, yes. okay. Yeah. Yeah, so. you can get a massage. So, you know, after you're finished getting your hair done, you just want to lay down. You can get a massage, deep tissue, prenatal, sports. You know, it's really important, I think, to be able to have a day for yourself. So you yeah. can go through each station and schedule all your services. Right. And I love the fact that you have products here. So yeah. you also retail products. And something that I didn't get to ask you about, but I, I heard that you sort of coined, or this is your thing, yeah. lock method, L-O-C, which I've seen <laughs> around everywhere, and I didn't know that that came from you. So. Tell me, what is LOC, Lock Method? Um, it's super popular, and then we have some stuff we can show people how to do it, so tell me about that. Yeah, so the um, LOC Lock Method, I actually coined it back in 2009, around that time. Okay. Um, a lot of people were trying to figure out how to really get their natural hair to be moisturized. It was in the beginning of like our natural hair movement, and I read a book from Chikoro, it's called Grow It, and all she talks about is stealing the moisture. But no one, and I couldn't remember the steps, like, how do I do it, which one? So I created the acronym LOC, C, liquid oil and cream. So I coined the term the lock method. It's one of the things though that it became so popular and but so You never fast. know who is like, yeah. like these sayings of like who started this. Yeah, That's and it's awesome. like I'm like, hey, you know, I did, but mm -hmm. it's just really cool to be able to see how it's really helped so many people along their natural hair journey. Wow, so okay, liquid. Liquid for us is going to be this leave-in. So yeah. is this pretty much we can just use a leave-in? Yep. A liquid is a, a liquid-based leave-in conditioner. Okay. And so that's something that's important to remember. Okay. Liquid-based leave-in leave -in conditioner. And what, I'm just spraying that on. Yep. Just spraying it onto your hair because it's the first thing that's going to touch your hair after you've now cleansed or washed it. Okay. Yeah. And then the next step is oil. Yep. Oil. And so the oil, the oil step, it has to be a lightweight oil. So okay. for this, this is our glazed argan oil hair silkener. Or you can even use our shine craze flosser as well. But it has to be really light because you don't want that heavy, heavy look. The whole point is for it to seal in your liquid base leave in. So the oil seal, seals in the liquid. Yep, the oil seals in the liquid. Okay, and then C stands for cream. Yep, the C is for cream. And this is the one that a lot of people are like really, you know, sticky about because it's like, oh my gosh, what can, you know, what is considered as a cream moisturizer? So our cream based moisturizers are the Shea Yogurt Hair Moisturizer or the Moisture Rich Hair Parfait, which is a lighter version of the yogurt. But the most important thing is you want to use a cream based leave in, I'm sorry, a cream based moisturizer that is not too heavy. So just a little bit goes a long way because you already have You've two already, other steps. Right, yeah. okay. And so I'm doing this after I shampoo condition. Yep. And then am I doing it kind of like maybe 
nightly? No, you actually, the most important thing for the lock method is you want to do it the day you actually shampoo and condition your hair. Okay. Because your cuticles are open at that point. And so what the liquid and the oil and the cream are doing is they're helping to really seal the moisture and put this multiple barrier of moisture in your hair. Wow. So as you go throughout the week and your hair loses a little bit of moisture, with triple protection, it's going to be like extremely moisturized. And dryness is like the key, dryness is the key thing that a lot of natural girls are looking yeah. for. So did I miss, was there anything else in the salon? We've got the hair, we have nails, we have massage. Um, yeah, so with our, again, with our hair services, with your real hair as well, of course, yeah. we're really like key on healthy hair treatment. So you can come in, you can get your hair steam treated, your nice. trims, your cuts. And it's really important because even with the color services that we do here, you can feel confident coming to BFAB and getting your hair colored by a professional yes. and knowing that it's going to look amazing and your hair will still be healthy afterwards. Wow. But we have a variety of services, lashes, threading, all makeup. of that. Makeup. Oh my gosh. You see my face? Merlin, eat my face to the gods. <laughs> but so yeah, I can so make a makeup appointment too. So yeah. I literally, if I'm having like a hot date, I can come in, get these dressed, yep. get my hair nailed done. Yep, everything. And then get my makeup done and go out and be cute. Everything. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah. Well, thank you for having me. Yeah, thank you so much for coming. You got it. Yeah. Let's have cool. a little. We have to toast. Yes. Celebrating one year of the fabulous salon. Exactly. And my first time in Fort Myers. Yes. yes. And so we're going to be having our anniversary party with our team in two days. So awesome. we'll definitely send some info from that. I'll toast to that. Toast to it. Cheers. Cheers.